the end of it, what you'll say is, you will not go there. Why do you want to go again? So that is where you will come to know this is not the reality, but this is what you have been faking about it. Now, if you are going to have this kind of an affection, what is the reciprocation that you will get from our children? Children, what they get? What? you can get is not acceptance ni your parents are irukirad vand that's what i said you have authority as parents it is either you believe it is not given or you believe that you have been put in authority for your parents for your children now in the authority irukumbodhu that is no doubt about the authority but are you able to have that affection and the affection moolamaga avanga unga kitta vandu are they willing to appreciate you as parents that is the question i want to put it to you are they able to appreciate you as parents as people who you think you are ninga vandu or if if you are going to have as parents some sort of a thought that goes into you saying that i will try to do it for few months i will try to do it for few uh, weeks after you are thinking and maybe at the end of two weeks you will burst out okay now as i said something about uh, an example before now what is the meaning of affection out in by the united is a gentle liking towards a person it's being gentle but still being able to show the liking through the expression above all gentle i want to how can we show this affection and how can we show this authority is what we need to think about nigar we have come here for women's day just a small thought we all show affection to each other we all show affections at our house we all show affection to our parents to our children to everybody around now the whole point is this baby follow me today you i want to ask yourself follow me ungude in the affection is it real or is it fake or well any any inga irukla i mean i am also talking to everybody in this room your affection could be fake your affection should be real which means and the affection edunala varudhu abindrada we have to think about it now our affection should be shown so that it can bring appreciation to what we display as expressions now it is promo important and that is what is this expression that we are expecting from our children now what is the expression that we expect from our husbands what is the expression that we can receive and rather one mukhyamana vishayam now for the next 2 or 3 minutes i just want you to listen very carefully and if you can help some children to be calm it will be helpful now i know about a person உங்களுக்கு எல்லாருக்கும் தெரிஞ்சது உங்களுடைய குழந்தை வாழ்க்கையில் இருக்கும்போது தேர் வுட் ஹேவ் பின் சம்படி ஹூ யூ ஹேவ் பின் இன்ஃப்ளூயன்ஸ் மேபி உங்களுடைய டீச்சராக இருக்கலாம் ஐ மீன் மெனி ஆஃப் யூ சிட்டிங் ஹேவ் மைட் பி இன்ஃப்ளூயன்ஸ் பை அ டீச்சர் இன் யூர் யங்கர் ஏஜஸ் ஐ ஹேட் அ டீச்சர் ஹூ ஹேட் இன்ஃப்ளூயன்ஸ் மீ இன் மை லைஃப் என்னுடைய சின்ன வாழ்க்கையில் ஐ வென் டு ஸ்கூல் அண்ட் ஹி செட் திஸ் டு மீ யூ நீட் டு டேர்ன் யுவர் இன்சைட் out abin sonar the word inside out so now ne i didn't understand what exactly is inside out that he is talking about then he went on to explain it is something deep within the mind and the human soul and he said if you can influence that it can use it can be used as a powerful tool it is like a double edged sword cutting across between the soul and your innermost being let me read it once again the words that you have inside of you is like a double edged sword which can cut across between the 
joint and the marrow, between the soul and the spirit. Now it exposes our inner being to the expression that we have outside. Now it is very important and our thought that he gave me. I was thinking, what is that innermost being inside me, and what is that most important thing? And the yena kulla hai or varthe irukide. And the word, what is that word? And can this word be active inside me? That is the question I started asking myself. And he went on to tell me, if this and the varthe ungal kulla irinte chena, adu ungal matra mudiyo. And then this can actually. Bring in a peace of mind inside your heart. Now I wanted to know what is this word about, so I went on to understand. Because when this word, he what he said was, when this word comes into me, I can be active, and in the Maria and the affection, coming back to that point of affection, Maria and the you don't have to fake because. This word, which is active inside you, can make you real. Maybe you are sitting here in this place, and you might be thinking, probably my relationships with my husband, my relationship with my wife, my relationship with my in-laws, my relationship with my family members. Sela karingal, I believe it's displaced. In that case, I want you to look into this word that says it is a double-edged sword which can cut across within you. Now it can cut across within your body, the mind, and the soul. And the word that you have learned, it is an active and a live word which can help you to change from the inside out. That is what he told me. And the word that inside out and so on, it is nothing but how can your expressions be changed because your internal beings are transformed. Now that is what we all call as the word of God. Now you might be sitting here and thinking, how can this word of God change me? Now there are so many values that we know. If I'm thinking, affection is also a value. Affection is a value. Expression of love is a value. And in the love or affection, if it has to be real, then those things which are underneath your value systems, which are underneath your belief systems, which are underneath and governing our entire thought process, must be changed. And if we can change that thought process. Then our values are going to be changed, and when our values are going to be changed, our relationship with our people around is going to be natural. Al Kapro, we don't really need to fake it. We don't really need to think about what we need to talk. Automatic way, when we speak, we will have the affection, and when we have such an affection with people around us, and when we speak to children, then they will know. Not just know, rather, then they will start appreciating us. And the Maria over the Ullan over the Sindhela, and among the very Parama Hilam, Ullan or Sindhela, if we can actually talk to the children, talk to our parents, talk to our friends, talk to our relatives, talk to our husbands, wives, then it is going to bring in a change. Now, this word is a living word. And this word is the word that can transform us. Now, if you are sitting here in this place, and if you want to know something more about the word, then I think we can sit and talk about it. We need to talk about this so that you can know, you can understand the word in a deeper sense. When we make a positive impact with those. Words that are inside us, it can make a positive impact out of us. For a minute, I just want you to close your eyes. Maybe you're a parent here, sitting in this place, 
and you want to say probably this is something that there is something that has displaced in my life in this case we we just going to pray for a few minutes for everyone so first thing i want to pray is for those people uh, who feel that my relationship with my husband enude relationship in a manavi oda enude relationship enude purushanoda edho or karyathukaga displace aayirukku or maybe the relationship between my husband and wife or my children or a displace aayirukla or maybe my friends the relationship is displaced and maybe there are some people in this room who wants to know more about it who it is i just want you to just close your eyes and if you want to be prayed for if you want that we can pray over you and if you want to know more about this word i just want you to probably raise your hands as everybody has closed their eyes and we will pray for you maybe 2 minutes we just want to give you an opportunity in the edith class if you have something you want to pray for or an owner of a relationship like there is something that you want to share about we are open after this meeting maybe if there is something that you want to talk about about the word that can help you bring about a expression which can change your life we want to talk to you let's all close our eyes for a few minutes and then pray father god thank you for this time thank you for this opportunity that you helped us to share thank you for helping us to know that there is a living word within us and when we have the living word inside of us we can change ourselves inside out then we don't don't really need to fake it then we don't really need to change it then we don't really need to talk with words but we can express through our actions so that we can move from a position of authority to a position of affection and from a position of affection to a position of appreciation by the children by our parents by our friends by our relatives thank you father for helping us know this that there is a way help us and guide us through this time so that we can continue to know you more in jesus name i pray amen thank you brother for the message